I think it's evident that the face of leadership is changing. Um, I think that we are in the midst of a new era where uh, young people are not just being represented, but young people are actually helping to shape uh, the discourse and shape the trajectory of humanity. Um, and I think that's incredibly important. And I think what uh, the Valuable 500 initiative uh, is demonstrating is that leadership can be embodied by all segments of society, regardless of who you are or where you come from. We have enormous capacity for ingenuity, and we bring value not only to our communities and to our workspaces, but we bring value to the globe as a whole. And so this is not just a personal um, achievement for the Valuable 500 and, and for the corporations that are signed onto it, but it is a for people with disabilities everywhere. This is an incredible turning point. And as one of the UN Secretary General's advocates for the SDGs, we um, are uh, celebrating the announcement of the Decade of Action. And we know that business is an incredible force for change and for transformation. And the moment disability inclusion is on the agenda of business, that means it's going to be on the agenda of policy as well. So there's a demand for talent um, and the recognition of people with disabilities. That means that we can start working on the supply side as well. We can start improving outcomes for people with disabilities on the ground, children with disabilities as well, so that one day we can say that it's not 90% of children with disabilities that have never seen the inside of a classroom, but 90% of children with disabilities having access to the basic building blocks of life so that they can triumph.